Hi you, welcome in. It's been a bit again, fudging depression and sleep issues. Oh, it has been a rather crappy time for me. And I don't know, hopefully this is a sign of that it's getting better again because I'm able to record. We will have to hola tu mana, cross our fingers. This is what we do in Sweden. Uh, I think this is what you do in the rest of the world. I think. I uh, also want to say like a huge thank you for freaking 10k, 10k subscribers. It is wow, really, really wild. I kind of missed it because I've been so checked out in depression. I've just been who uh, in the darkness, so to say. But I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much for subscribing. Um, yeah, thank you. I thought we could do a Q and A to celebrate because uh, you all might not know that much of me about me that is <laughs> so if you're interested in knowing more about me uh let me know in the comments down below if you have any questions i'll probably put like a community post up at some point as well with like hey uh q a what what you want to know and then i'll record a video sounds good i think so and uh, actually my birthday is coming up in just a few days here i think this video will probably go up yeah it will go up after my birthday but birthday income and i'm gonna be spending it watching lord of the rings lord of the rings marathon it's extended edition of course as always and i ordered a cake for myself i'm gonna have a princess cake if you're swedish princess torta you know what that is and i'm getting a pink one since it's my favorite color um yeah i am probably gonna be by myself for my birthday but i don't mind uh it's gonna be a nice time i'm just gonna eat the cake watch uh, the trilogy, eat some good food, maybe as well. I'm not sure what though, but yeah. But for tonight, we're going to be watching X-Men from, what was it, 2000? 2000? Yes. Um, I don't know if this is a new or the old one, because apparently there's a new and old one. I think, I, I'm not sure. Um, I asked chat about like, kind of superhero-ish movies, because I've seen a lot of the Marvels already uh, and they recommended this so i'm excited to watch x-men see what it's about especially also since it has suki in it well the actor's name is not suki but she plays suki in true blood and i absolutely love true blood that is a great show and uh, yeah it's gonna be fun to see her in another role exciting um we should get started by the way let's go every few hundred millennia evolution leaps forward millennia how long is a millennia is that a thousand years 10 is a decade right a hundred is a decennium no oh my gosh i probably should know that 1944 oh so it's a it takes place in the past oh no is this the second world war oh i don't know if i can cope with any like suffering and stuff on me the um, reality of now is horrible enough. Yeah, I think this must this, this, this is supposed to be a concentration camp, right? Yeah. Oh no, they got separated. Okay, this was not a good good beginning. <laughs> What's happening? Oh, is the boy doing that? Like pulling it towards him? <gasps> Ow! So that's one of the like, I'm guessing one of those mut mutations they talked about. Mississippi, not too distant future. So this is kind of present time. Only a few hundred miles to Anchorage. Oh my gosh, it's Suki! Well, that's the point, stupid. Otherwise, it wouldn't be an adventure. She looks so different in the dark hair. Oh, teenage love. It's a special time of one's life. What does that sound? Is he having like a heart attack or something? I've heard of people having heart attacks like in the middle of sex, but usually like older people, right? I didn't mean to call an ambulance. What? 
Are you call an ambulance? Wait, she thinks she killed him? Are mutants dangerous? I'm afraid that's an unfair question, Senator Kelly. After all, the wrong person behind the wheel of a car can be dangerous. True. To force mutants to expose themselves will only further Expose subject... themselves? What is it the mutant community has to hide, I wonder, that makes them so afraid to identify themselves? Oof, he's one of them people. A girl in Illinois who can walk through walls. Now, what's to stop her from walking into a bank vault or into the White House? Well, her ethics? Why is it so hard to understand the concept that just because you can do something doesn't mean that you are going to do it? Again, if you have good ethics and you're a good person, you're not going to be doing bad stuff, right? The truth is that mutants are very real. And they are among us. We must know who they are. And above all, we must know what they can do. Fear mongering and othering. This hits a little too hard with reality, too. Hmm, mysterious figure with a hat. Eric. Is he a bad person? What are you doing here? Oh, he's probably a mutant. Why do you ask questions to which you already know the answers? <gasps> Gandalf! Don't give up on them, Eric. You're sneaking around in your jaws. Whatever you're looking for. He can read minds? Ah, <gasps> Sir Ian McKellen. I'm looking for hope. I will bring you hope, old friend. He has such a great voice. Don't get in my way. In the way of what? Are you the good guy or the bad guy in this movie? Because the way they are filming it, he's coming across as the bad guy. Or at least that he has something to hide. This is it. What is she doing in a truck? Did she run away from home? I thought you said you were going to take me as far as Laughlin City. This is Laughlin City. That is a city? It looks like a big barn to me. Oh. I don't understand how this is entertaining. I, re I really fail to see it, seeing people beat each other. But he's one of those cocky people who think just because he's like big and muscular, he's gonna win. Size doesn't matter. Okay, maybe it matters. Ow. Oh my gosh. He's really kicking the crap out of him. Whoa. Oh, he's a mutant, right? Wolverine. Isn't Wolverine supposed to be like half human, half werewolf? Isn't that like the... Isn't there some kind of myth or something? Maybe I'm confused. Promises to be the largest single gathering of world leaders in history. Okay, so that's gonna be important for the movie. You owe me some money. Come on, let's do it. What? No man takes a beating like that without a mark to show for it. Oh, he suspects. Look out! <gasps> Oh, convenient. Oh, that's the barkeeper. He was just, whoa. He was just defending himself. Why would you have a problem with him and not the man who randomly attacks people because he's a sore loser? Oh. Is she gonna follow him? Because now she knows she is like him, because I guess she's... A mutant too then, if what she says is true that she killed the boy. Which I'm still not sure how that would work. I think he might have just have had a heart attack. Oh yeah, it must hurt to get like blades shooting out of your knuckles. Is that what? Yeah. Can't be comfortable at least. It's the girl, right? Suki. Or whatever her name is in this movie. Where am I supposed to go? I don't know. You don't know or you don't care. Pick one. I saved your life. No, you didn't. Well, she did try to warn you. She did you a good turn. I'm Rogue. Rogue? Cool name. Suddenly, my life doesn't look that bad. Hey, if you prefer no, the road. No. It looks great. I was thinking that, like, maybe not insult the person who's you kind of, like, dependent on to get you somewhere. 
when they come out. Does it hurt? It has to, right? Every time. I hope at least he can troll it so he can avoid it. So what kind of a name is Rogue? I don't know. What kind of a name is Wolverine? Fair question. My name's Logan. Hmm. Marie. Oh, so she was using like a nickname. Where are your seatbelt? Hey, look, it, I don't need advice on auto. <laughs> now right don't you die if you go through the windshield like that oh okay he's moving oh wow he like flew a long way oh what he has like super magic healing oh is this an ambush of some kind What is that? Is it an animal? A human? I. Oh, is that a like a gas tank? More people arriving. Oh, cool. Wow, laser beams. Oh. Well, that was just in time. Oh. Well, they would be dead in real life because if it knocks you over, you would die. But plot armor, right? What are you supposed to bring someone back with you? Who was he supposed to bring back with him? What happened? They knew. Who knew? Like the people that came and fought you? Are those balls floating in the air? He's the boy from the beginning. I have made the first move. That is all they know. He wants Wolverine. The UN summit is approaching. Time for our little test. Okay, so he is the bad guy. The balls fell. Oh, because he can do magnetic stuff. Of course. That's the lady from the speech place. Why are you touching him like that? That seems inappropriate. It's kind of creepy. Unless I guess she knows him. But even then... He's... <gasps> okay, nobody warned me that this, this was gonna be a scary movie. To be fair, I seem to be <laughs> kind of sensible... Sen not sensible. Sensitive! Oh my gosh, English is hard sometimes. What is this place? Uniforms. Kind of looks like a medical facility with that table he was on. Where are you going? Is that the guy that was in the wheelchair's voice? Where are you going? This way. He's over there. Is he hearing this in his head? Because I don't see anyone. Over here. Are those kids? Okay. Oh, where is Rogue? Or Marie? Is she okay? Good morning, Logan. Oh. Did he, like, end up exactly where the man in the wheelchair wanted him to end up? Because I'm kind of getting the feel that... Physics. So that's the girl that can walk through walls. I'd like you to meet Aurora Monroe, also called Storm. This is Scott Summers, yeah. also called Cyclops. Name. Is that Teddy from Westworld? It's been almost 15 years, hasn't it? Living from day to day, moving from place to place, with no memory of who or what you are. Shut up. What? How does he know that? Why doesn't he know his past? You're not the only one with gifts. Where are you going? Where's he going? He's over there. What are you? So it was him in his mind, indeed. What is this place? He said it was a school for mutants. Some with gifts so extreme that they've become a danger to themselves and those around them. Like your friend Rogue, incapable of physical human contact. What? That's awful. She can never touch another human ever again. To become what the children have affectionately called X-Men. 
Welcome to Mutant High. Rose. Now that's cute. So they call it X-Men, the kids. Okay. That's where the name come from. When I was a boy, I discovered I had the power to control people's minds, make them think or do whatever I wanted. That's a lot of power. Eric Lenscher. He too had an unusual power. Believing that humanity would never accept us, he he grew angry and vengeful. I mean, it's kind of understandable how he was treated, right? Give me 48 hours to find out what Magneto wants with you. And I give you my word that I will use all my power to help you piece together what you've lost. How is he gonna do that, though? Does he have access to, like, records or something, perhaps? <laughs> People that give in to their hate like that, oosh, some of the most scariest people in the world. Well, some of these so-called children possess more than 10 times the destructive force of any handgun. No, I don't see a difference. All I see are weapons in our schools. Have they done something about actual weapons in the schools in this future? If it were up to me, I'd lock them all away. Of course you would. You're not a good person. Did something happen to him in his past by a mutant or something? Like, does he have like a private score in this? What the heck? Oh, uh, dude. Oh, oh my. People like you are the reason I was afraid to go to school as a child. Yeah, you tell him, lady. Those are some impressive feet skills right there. I take it the pilot is also a mutant? I'm sorry. For what? If I hurt you. That's good of him to apologize. She should apologize for inappropriately touching him though, because they don't know each other. Couldn't wait to get my shirt off again, huh? Appropriate joke considers what she did what she did, I guess. Is that like an x-ray? Yeah, I would panic being in that. The metal is an alloy called adamantium. Supposedly indestructible. It's been surgically grafted to his entire skeleton. Wait, so... So the blades aren't a natural part of him? Who did this to him? He doesn't know. Nor does he remember anything about his life before it happened. That's awful. Can they take it out? What do you think Magneto wants with him? Not entirely sure it's him Magneto wants. He thinks he wants the the girl? He wants Rogue? Oh yeah, you're in trouble now. Oh! What the fudge? Where's Henry? Mr. Gyrich has been dead for some time, Senator. But I've had Mystique here keep you company. Mystique? Cool name again. Whatever you do to me, you'll make me right. Every word I've spoken will be confirmed. Sadly, yes. But I guess she can just replace him. I've always thought of God as a teacher. As a bringer of light, wisdom, and understanding. Which God? The one that drowned the whole earth, supposedly? Killing how many people? Or some other kind of God? What is their religion in the future, I guess? Can be something else? And certainly don't fear me. Not anymore. What do you mean not anymore? Are you gonna become a better person? What is he doing? Oh, that looks painful. Why is he doing that to himself? Wow. Pretty. What did it do? Beyond looking pretty? What was the purpose? Actually, I'm telekinetic. I can move things with my mind. Oh. I also have some telepathic ability. Well, like a professor? Nowhere near that powerful. I would not want to be able to read people's minds. Maybe she can find repressed memories? I think she is, yeah! Scott. Why don't he speak? The Scott person. He hasn't said a word so far. Oh, and Logan. Stay away from my girl. It's not your girl, and she's a woman. She's her own woman. I half expected them to like whip theirs out to be like doing a measurement contest because it feels like the bar, <laughs> the bar of the behavior is so low. Uh -huh. All right. All right. He has nightmares. Understandable if he has a lot of repressed stuff. Oh. 
What the heck? What were they doing to him? Were they drinking champagne? Did he just kill her? Help me! No! Will he die now? Is she able to, like, suck his healing ability out of him? Will he be okay? Logan. What happened? Oh, he's fine. Whenever Rogue touches someone, she takes their energy, their life force. In the case of mutants, she absorbs their gifts for a short while. In your case, your ability to heal. That's kind of cool. I feel like she almost killed me. If she'd held out any longer, she could have. So, if she kills a mutant with her power... Would she only have their power, like, temporarily, even if she, like, full-on kills them? She'd become, like, a super mutant if she could steal everyone's uh, powers. But she would become a bad, a bad guy if she did. Oh. Oh, he mutated him! Oh my gosh, that is such a 200 IQ thing to do, though. If you make all the people that hate mutants, mutants, are they still gonna... Oh, but looking at that one party leader in Germany, the the lesbian lady. Yeah, mm, I don't know if it would if it would help enough. Where would you go? Who would take you in now that you're one of us? You're alive and you've stopped making people othering people then oh no 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 oh my gosh he turns oh why i guess they didn't foresee that that was gonna happen oh he's not happy maybe you can send someone to fish him up oh it wasn't his fault what is he doing that to the little Oh, everyone is gonna see that he is one now. No, no, I, I, I borrowed his power. You never use your power against another mutant. She would have died. You, you, you if have I were you, me. I'd get myself out of here. What? Listen, the students are freaked. Professor Xavier is furious. I don't know what he'll do with you. That seems so out of character. He seemed, he seemed genuinely nice. But I guess looks can be very deceiving. It's not very kind at all. How is she gonna manage on her? What are you looking? Oh, it's the blue lady. Mm -hmm. So they want, they want her. Welcome to Cerebro. Cerebro? Isn't that something in the body, like the cerebral cortex, right? Is that the thing that connects your brain, right? That's how I intend to find Rogue. Why don't you just use it to find Magneto? I've been trying, but he seems to have found some way to shield himself from it. Hmm. How would he know how to do that? Because he helped me build it. Oh. So they were friends for like a long time then. It takes a degree of control and uh, for someone like me, it's... Dangerous. Really? Dangerous in what way? Would it like fry her brain? Whoa. Okay, that is very cool. Kind of creepy though that he can like spy on people almost, I guess. Oh, she's at a train station? Logan, you can't leave the mansion. It's just the opportunity Magneto needs. Listen, I'm the reason she took off. So, Cyclops, find her. See if you can talk to her. I think Logan would have a better chance because she has more of a bond with him. And I think she trusts him more. Where's my motorcycle? I was about to say, of course he has a motorcycle, and you know, Logan stole it. He found her. But how are we supposed to know that it's him and not Mystique, the blue lady? When's the last time you saw her? She was supposed to meet me for lunch. Because it wasn't him. Oh, she's still walking around in the school. Oh. Welcome, Professor. 
so she copies even like the retina and everything. So she's not gonna use it, she's gonna destroy it, blow it up, poison it. The first boy I ever kissed ended up in a coma for three weeks. I can still feel him inside my head. That must be awful, the guilt. But he didn't die, that's good. I presume he woke up from the coma or... There's not many people that'll understand what you're going through. But I think this guy, Xavier, is one of them. He seems to genuinely want to help you. And that's a rare thing. I agree with that. You should go back. You'll be safer there. What do you say? Give these geeks one more shot. He turned out to be such a good guy. I hope he doesn't let her down. My height has brown hair. Oh. So he let him out of the little prison cell. Oh, the lizard dude. Oh, whoa! <gasps> what? <gasps> Electrocute him. All right. Quit playing around. Wait, he's not dead from that? Yeah, they're coming for her. Oh, he's here himself. Does that mean that he can control Logan too since he has all that metal inside of him? And he flies. That remarkable metal doesn't run through your entire body, does it? Oh, he can. Ow! Oh no! Stop it! <laughs> Whoever said I wanted you. Yeah, he wants Rogue. What is that? Oh. Young people. No, I'm pretty sure anyone of any age would be running away from you. Alright, hold it. Hold it right there. Stay where you are. Put your hands over your head. And they're all gonna shoot metal bullets and he's just gonna be like Oh no, he's gonna lift the car up. That works too. Are they gone now or they no they're still there? Oh he takes the whole gun! Of course. Oh and turns them around. You homo sapiens and your guns. What? Why not come out when I can see you, Charles? Oh let them pass that law and they'll have you in chains with a number burned into your forehead won't be that way. Then kill me and find out. He won't be able to kill him. Fine. <gasps> you can't let them have Rogue though. So many more people are gonna die. I think it's just gonna be worse if you let him have her. Still unwilling to make sacrifices. That's what makes you weak. No, it's what makes him a better person than you. But I'm worried that the end result is gonna be worse. And what life he saves here is gonna be worse. I'm fearful. But maybe they will stop her, stop him later on. Maybe we'll be fine. Where are you going? I'm gonna find her. How? Oh. The traditional way, look. But the world is rather large. Oh. It's him. I'm looking for Dr. Jean Grey. So now they will know what his plan is. We're not what you think. Not all of us. I look to the ones who did this to me. Well, humans do awful things too. It's not because of something you are, it's because of something you choose. I guess the exception would be like actual psychopaths and such because they are they're born with something, right? It's not a choice. Yeah, I think he's gonna use this probably at that UN thingy, right? Make all the leaders of the world mutants. Pretty effective, smart plan. And also, it doesn't kill anybody. Well, not directly unless people start killing mutants, which was the senator's kind of goal, right? Or at least locking them up. Oh, it tires him out. Whoa. Oh. 
How many times can he do that without damaging himself too severely? So what does Magneto want with Rogue? I don't know. Is he going to put her in the machine? In fact, it nearly killed him. He's going to transfer his power to Rogue and use her to power the machine. Oh, because he, he knows if he does it again, he's going to die. So he's going to sacrifice Rogue? Please don't leave me. Don't want to be alone. So he's dying. Then it's not going to be doing anything good if all it's going to do is kill them slowly. Oh. oh! Oh! this is oh! This is very, very gross to look at. So he just became water. Senator Kelly is dead. I'm going to find her. Oh no! 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 I've she put the thing in the thingy. What is it going to do to him? Oh. Will it kill him? Oh no. Is he dead? What is going to happen to all the kids now? They needed him. Well, you're gonna have to use the machine now to find Rogue, right? She's the only one. Yeah, you have to use it. Find Rogue. But if anything happens, I'll take care of them. I don't know if you have the right attitude, dude. You're a tad too toxic. No! She's already in it, it's too late. Oh yeah, she could- oh no, I forgot about that, she could die from it! Jane? Did she find her? I know where Magneto's going. The UN thing, right? There's no reason they would be mentioning that if, if it wasn't the case, right? Oh. Oh. Uh. No. She would be a cool cosplay, the Mystique Lady. You would have to kind of do body paint, though. Are you going to kill me? Yes. At least he's honest. Well, after tonight, the world's powerful will be just like us. They will return home as brothers. As mutants. Does he know that it kills them, though? He doesn't know his machine kills. And judging from what the professor saw, if Magneto gave Rogue enough power, he could wipe out everyone in New York City. Holy... Oh, that's a cool map, though. Do you actually go outside in these things? What would you prefer? Yellow spandex? <laughs> I mean, yellow spandex would be more flexible, easier to move in than what seems to be like leather. Oh, <laughs> he was checking whether or not the blades could go through the gloves. Actually, kind of good idea. Storm, some cover, please. Oh, can even she makes like clouds and stuff too? Not just snowstorms and uh, um, electricity things? Lightning. Toad, Mystique, stay sharp. We're not alone. Oh, he knows they're there. Once I give my power to the girl, I'll be temporarily weakened. You'll be my only defense. Hmm. That's a lot of trust to put in that man. <laughs> they gonna go for a swim? Sorry? You call that a landing? cares? You landed safely. It was a little bumpy. Oh my gosh. The torch. This thing was originally made for like the World Fair or something like that, right? And made in France, was it? Or something like that? Pretty. I've never seen it. I've never been to New York. Oh! <laughs> of course! A metal detector. <laughs> But yeah, I've never been to New York. Oh, that's her. So she can turn into what? Like anonymous objects? No, that, that's not the word. Inanimate objects? Anything? I know there's someone here. I just can't see him. Oh, that's... It's her. How are you going to know who is who? Holy yuck. 
Okay, if I had to be a mutant, I really would not like to be a lizard mutant. What's he doing? Is he just mocking her? Oh! Oh, yuck! Wait, did I go over both her mouth and nose so she will suffocate? Ow. Can she use her powers inside without access to uh, the fresh air and like... That's also a way of opening a door. Oh, here we go! Who is playing her is probably not an actor I've ever seen, but I feel like even if it was an actor I knew, I would have a hard time recognizing her with all the all the makeup. Don't move. <coughs> what if he had just slightly over calibrated and hurt her, but I guess she would have died from suffocation otherwise. Uh, uh, electrocute him. Oh, that looks so cool, though. Kind of badass. Bye bye. Ah. <laughs> oh. Let go. Do you know what happens to a toad when it's struck by lightning? I don't know, but you should freeze his tongue to the pole instead. Like, make it really, really cold. The same thing that happens to everything else. Oh. I actually thought there was gonna be something special that happens to a frog. I don't see the point of that line. Those are some Logan, giant toads. Is that you? Toads? Toes. Wow. I'm struggling with my English today. Come on. We have to regroup. I know, it's but there's a problem. Logan though. Oh no, it's not. You're not part of the group. Oh. Oh, is she dead now? Oh, the details of her body makeup is really pretty. That must have taken hours to put on. It's me. Prove it. Cause it... You're a dick. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that might be my favorite scene so far. That was funny. Everybody get out of here. Oh, is what he is already it? started? I can't move. Ow. Oh, that's why he shows this too, because the statue's made of metal. You better close your eyes. <gasps> Storm, fry him. Oh yes, a bolt of lightning into a huge copper conductor. They have to tell him that they die, but I doubt it will change his mind. Soon our fate will be theirs. I don't think it will accomplish what he wants anyway. Even if the newly made mutants were to survive. Somebody, please help me! <sighs> this is gonna be awful having to hear her die. What is happening to him? Oh! So he hurt himself to be able to cut down from the wall. Is he gonna think that he is dead? Oof. Yeah, don't fall down. He's gonna window. I'm sorry, don't do this. As if your sorry matters. A sorry without action is just manipulation. This is mine. Oh, he got his thingy back. Nice. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Oh, maybe he can let his friends loose. That would be good, and they could help. Or maybe he doesn't consider them friends yet, but they're on the same side at least, so... Allies? Open your eyes. No, trust me. You drop something. No. Wouldn't he be... Oh. Smart. Yeah, you ain't got a bodyguard anymore. And you're weakened. Hang on to something. She doing like a tornado or something? Oh. oh! Okay, stop the wind now. Oh, are they gonna be too late? Oh, he still has enough power to stop him? Really? 
Oh! Oh, her hair is becoming white. Did one of those people stand up to start clapping, thinking it's like part of the fireworks or something? I have a shot. I'm taking it. Oh. oh, nice. Oh, they did it. Good job. Is Rogue and Logan safe though? Or what happened to them? Oh, here they are. Okay. Is she alive? Did he do it in time? She's fine, right? She's fine. She's fine. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Give her some of, of yes, your healing power. Please work. Please work. Is it not work? Hey, is she dead? No, what really? What? I thought she's kind of like a main character, right? Main characters doesn't die. Oh, oh, is she alive? Yes. Oh, okay. Okay, you gotta let go. Let go. Oh. Oh, he is not gonna die now instead, right? She didn't hold on for that long. He's he is also a main character. He cannot die. This one's alive. Let's get him out of here. Oh. Uh oh. That's the mystique lady. They have to leave before they get arrested. Oh, okay. But they left him behind. So is he gonna get arrested by the cops now? He blinks. He didn't die. How did we do? Is he not healing? Did she take too much from him? Oh, he is healing. Okay, oh. he's good. Oh, it tickles. Hey. Are they gonna end up liking, liking each other? I think she's a little taken with you. Wow. Well. You can tell her my heart belongs to someone else. You know, you and I... How's the professor? Yeah, he might not have meant you. The dramatic reversal of Senator Robert Kelly. Who until this time, it provided the loudest voice in the cry for mutant registration. Wait, he's alive? Thank you. The Mutant Registration Act continues to draw support. Mystique. Mm, she replaced him. She looks so happy. You should say goodbye. That's rude. There's some things to take care of up north. I kind of like it. Yeah, it looks looks nice. I don't want you to go. You'll be back. Oh. I'll be back for this. That is such a nice gesture. Because he could have just said, I will return, but this this solidifies it more. This gives more comfort. Is he gonna steal his bike again? Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't it ever wake you in the middle of the night? The feeling that someday they will pass that foolish law, or one just like it, and come for you and your children. I mean, of course, that's only normal to worry about it. I feel a great swell of pity for the poor soul who comes to that school looking for trouble. So they will defend themselves. They just, they're not going to be like proactive, proactive like Magneto wanted to be. Why do you come here, Charles? Why do you ask questions which you already know the answers? Oh, yes. You're continuing search for hope. I think he once really valued your friendship and is not ready to give up on you. The war is still coming, Charles, and I intend to fight it. And I will always be there, old friend. I'm so sad for Magneto that what happened to him, that he, he got turned into this. That's a high-tech kind of prison. 
How have they not used any kind of metal though to build it? Like how is it stable enough? Oh, it's not the end now. I was hoping we were gonna be able to go with Logan and see what he was gonna go find out. Is that gonna be in the next movie, right? Because I think there's like one or two more movies. I'm not sure. So that was X-Men and I really liked it. The, the start was um, too emotional and too like real. Um, I'm very much struggling at the moment at watching anything that is too dark, too much um, reality and horrors of the humankind. Um, but the, the majority of the movie was really, really good. I mean, I'm not saying that the start was bad, it's just... It hits too hard. Um, I like the actors. I think they all did a good job. I'm really intrigued by what is going to happen next. I'm super, super, super curious of what has been happening to Logan. And I really hope that that is something that's going to be uh, explained in the future movies. And I'm definitely watching them. And I think that the actress who plays Rogue did a really good job. I'm so pleased with having watched a other movie that she has acted in and this makes me feel like I should probably have a look at what else she's been in because she, she's really good at what she does definitely and it's also very interesting to see Sir Ian McKellen in this kind of role you know because I mean he's Gandalf right like that is it's it's him <laughs> and to see him here play the bad guy and um, just, you know, be kind of completely opposite, right? And uh, he did a good job too. Like, I, yeah, I, I'm so confused by the talent of these people. Or not confused, impressed is a better word. That they can take on these so vastly different roles and do it so well. Like, he was very convincing as this very you know, driven by revenge and, and, and by his trauma to, to make sure that trying to keep himself safe, right? So desperately, desperately wants to keep himself safe and the people that he care about, right? Because of what he went through as a child, which is so understandable, um, doesn't make it all right, of course, but, you know, we can, we can understand why that, that is his primal like kind of drive and what motivates him to do what he does. Uh, oh, he he did a fantastic job in this role, I think. I no, I like the movie all over. Good balance between like the action and then interaction between the characters and such. I feel like it was a good balanced movie. I enjoyed it. I uh, probably said that like four times now or something. <laughs> but yeah, I look forward to watching the next movie in uh, this X-Men series. I'm gonna have to look up how many movies there are um, and like let me know in the comments down below if there's a good order to watch the movies and such, if this is similar to Marvel's where it can be a bit confusing like timeline wise and uh, I hope you enjoyed watching with me and I will see you next time. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye!